Kiteboarding pumps, pumping kites is a pain in the butt. It just is. It's a fact of life. Um, we try and use a compressor or a compressed air tank as much as possible, but sometimes you just end up pumping. Um, what we have here is a new pump that, uh, this is a North branded pump, but it's not, you know, North didn't develop the technology. It's, it's another company. Um, and we're pretty excited about it. It's awesome, right? This is it here. This is a standard pump here from Slingshot, but this, the same kind of deal. All the pumps prior to this are pretty much the same. Cabrina had a Bravo pump that was a bit different. Um, so right out of the gate, you can see it's a bit higher. It's got a, a dome top on it so you can get a little more airflow. They both have the uh, leash here, right? Leash here. This one has an integrated um, pump gauge, and I'm not a huge fan of gauges. Uh, you know, the slingshot comes with a gauge, it's right here on the um, hose. This one's integrated, so you're not losing it, right? The handle is a bit different, it's wider. The bottom pegs are slanted back, which actually helps a ton. You, you know, if you pump, you know that you got to be right over this thing, kind of hitting it with your knees. With this one, your back clears your knees and the whole thing. Um, so if you pump one of these next to the other one at the same time, what you'll find is, I mean, it's just so much easier. This one just glides, right? This is harder to pump. It's kind of stuck on the top and the bottom, right? This thing just goes nice and easy up and down. The inside tubing, like the, um, the tubes inside that are made of um, aluminum are wider. So it's easier to get more airflow through those tubes. The hose is a no joke plastic hose. I mean, it's, it's no, it's not like these, these ones that have been coming with pumps for years, this sucker is hardcore, right? Comes with the normal attachment that fits on most every kite nowadays. And then it has the attachment for the ozone valve here, right? As well as the older slingshot valves or any nine millimeter in, inflate valve there, right? And they're on a nice bungee cord, so you're not gonna lose them. Um, we've been really impressed with this pump overall. So there's one G Wiz thing on it that I'm not a huge fan of, uh, but I get you know if you have a bad back it'll probably help you out. On the back side there's a little valve, okay? It's a relief valve. So if I take that out and I start pumping, it doesn't pump on the upstroke, right? So if you have lower back problems, you do it like this. Only pumps on the downstroke when you're using it with gravity, right? So it's a lot easier. If I put that back in. It pumps twice as fast, right? Because you're pumping on the up and the down. You know, and then you get two strokes out of it. Um, overall though, ergonomically, this is just a much better pump. They're a little more expensive. I think they're $55 on our website. We got them in stock. Um, feel free to do your own pump off test in the store. Come in and I'll let you do the exact same thing. Um, North kiteboarding pump, right? They really hit it out of the park. Boom. Uh-huh. Well, they'll be on our website, AmericanKiteboarding.com. Give us a call if you want to get one, 281-508-6485. We'll see you guys out on the water.